So what are we doing today, Zilrog? We're here for another watch of a movie we've already watched, except not really, because this came first. Yes. This was two. Years, this was two years before Jackie Ma, Best Bird, <laughs> proving that you can do impossible things if you have the budget for it. Yes. But you know who didn't have the budget for it? These guys is Golden Films. Golden Films. <laughs> They have no budget. No. And we watched uh, we watched their Hunchback, which is infamous because of YouTube-like reviews. Yeah. I saw it on Amazon. It had a... Uh, that's the only one of their films that had a, a bunch of Amazon reviews. And they're like, oh, this is so laughably bad. Yeah. But I'm sure the rest of the Golden Films library is similarly bad. Yes. We got material. Apparently, a lot of it's on Prime. Yeah. So we can watch for free. In fact... We're doing a double feature today. They're going to be two separate videos, but we here are going to watch back to back. Uh, Thumbelina, where is it? We, that that we had to get on DVD. Yeah, we had. To, how much did you pay for it? Five bucks. Five on bucks. Amazon. All right. So the a re regular Golden Films Thumbelina is not on Amazon Prime. Watch for free. So we had to buy that DVD for five bucks. We gave yes. money to Golden Films. Yeah. Well, so whoever's selling Golden Films shit. But uh, the sequel. I assume it's the sequel. Tom Thumb meets Thumbelina. That's free. Yeah, that's on Amazon. You can watch that for as long as you have Amazon Prime. <laughs> oh, man. We get to this. I, I don't think... The, the guy. I've heard of Golden Films through uh, Phelous. He runs yeah. a YouTube channel. And uh, and I think I don't think he's reviewed this one yet. No? Well, there are a lot of Golden Films. I can't blame him. <laughs> oh, at, man. We get to this before he does. It's going to be great. I'll put up a picture. Look at that. Look at this DVD cover with fake-ass Jockey Mo. <laughs> Just a derpy ass bluebird. Probably can't even talk. <laughs> He's flying on his back. Oh, I hope he does. She or she? I I don't know. What. Okay, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna boot this up. We didn't start the the disc yet because we wanna we wanna be fresh when we see the title screen. Yep. Is this? Do I just hit play? I guess is that? Oh, wrong screen. What's it? Is it loading QuickTime Player or Windows Move Media Player? I don't know. I it's, it's full loading. Screen. It's it's. Okay. Is it loading? Okay, it's there. There it is. Well, it's bland and generic. Yeah, like like most uh, good times stuff. Good times, golden films. Is that the same thing? <laughs> Are you just recording audio? Uh, no. We. Okay. Sorry. Let me uh, let me turn the screen on. I was trying to get it uh, full screen. It's still in the window. There, there we go. go. So, we can either... Wait, language selection? Oh, what yeah, this is, is this also in Spanish. Span... Espanol. Okay. Hola. I wonder... I wonder how, how good the Spanish, uh... Do you think it's worse than the English? I... I I don't know. I can't tell. I can't tell. Uh... Okay. So you've got a seed index. You know, yeah. in case you want to pick up where you left off. This fake jockey mo. That's nice. All right. So... We're going to dive into this. Blind, we've never seen this, and uh, stick around, I guess, if you bought the DVD too, or else, had, however you found this. Yeah. We're going to go now. All right. Oh, warning. It's This video disc is protected. It's protected. We thought maybe at first we could stream this, but we looked it up. It's actually not on YouTube. Like, they went through the effort. Someone uploaded it in parts. And the first part's gone. Yeah, someone took someone took down the first part of it. So, oh, well, we gotta watch this legally. Yeah, they care enough to uh, to take it off YouTube. Tom oh. Thumb meets Thumbelina, though. That's on YouTube in its entirety. But we're have pride. Oh, it's the kids from the Snowman. Yeah. Movie. Do you, <laughs> you remember that? Do we ever? Wait, this is just footage from the, on the Great Space Coaster. <laughs> yep. Hop aboard. And hey, lions. Look, more people. Is this this is just an advertisement for other Golden Films movies? Yes, it's uh. Hey, you're about to watch a Golden Film. Oh, this is yeah. This isn't even the movie. It's just fake Cinderella, fake Jungle Book, fake Alice in Wonderland, uh, fake Snow White. Look how magical it is, children's <laughs> classics. <laughs> into into the rainbow anus. <laughs> they all begin like this. Everyone, huh? Yep. This sounds like a one-take recording. Totally. Into a Goodwill microphone. <laughs> I love you! I love you! 
There sure are some flowers. So I did, uh... On with your adventure. I did read the back of the box. It's very brief. Yeah. But apparently... Apparently this movie has the polar opposite plot of the night of the Don Bluth one. Oh, really? That's not even possible. Uh... Let's see. She has to she has to journey to the meadow of the tulips to stop the spring thaw from washing away oh. her village. Oh, these tulips? Yeah, sure. Oh, hey, we found it. This is the meadow of the tulips. We're here. Movie's over. I don't like the looks of this at all. I neither do I. Narrator. One little bit. Oh, it's little it's little Geppetto thumb. Father? Always has. That's because you don't know what to look for. She has a father. She oh, didn't, she's not. So she's not be, Momotaro in this So one. she was naturally bored rather than. All right. Yeah. Come, I'll show you what I mean. <laughs> he looks so sad. So this is the opposite of. Uh, I mentioned in Don Bluth that he had a tendency to over animate, like there were too many frames. This is under animated. Yeah, this looks a little bit choppy. And, oh, just a little dance. That looks very jiffable. Yep. A little bit choppy in places. And here? Yeah. And here. Okay. They just look like tiny cracks to me. That's no, they are. You know what? I think I like that voice better than Tony, than Jody Bennett's or whatever her name was. There's going to be a lot of snow up in the mountains this winter. You can tell up from the... I just could. What do the mountains have to do with us? The cracks in the ground. Oh, yeah? This cold. This little, this little garden no motherfucker. This pond is higher than ever. The dam won't take the pressure. So, there are the dam won't the take the pressure! So, are they the same race as the borrowers? But, sure. All little but people are the same. All the people in the flowers live in the meadow. All except for you and me. Just oh. lost our entire uh, audience. Sometimes I wish I hadn't taken the job as watchkeeper of the dam all those years ago. All the, are you two the only ones left? No, they all left. Why are your clothes so shitty and her so pristine? Does, does he spend all his money on her clothes? Probably. Yes, we do. Oh! Luckily for us, spring is And you know this what? This is nothing like the original. Uh, the other no. one. And it's too far a journey for an old man like me. You need to do it. You need to fill the Pokedex in my place, Thumbelina. I can't do it. to reach the meadow. When you get there. Tell the prince about he looks like they probably used that exact same character model for a Santa Claus in another Golden Films movie. Ho, 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 ho! The prince will probably give you a medal. Just go, going straight into the plot, The prince will give you a medal! Do it! Go ride a bird to the Valley of the Tulips, which is not this Valley of Tulips, to get a medal from the prince. This... Sounds like a plot. Well, Let's do it. Food and water to last you a week, but there are plenty of nuts and berries along the way. Oh, stock, uh, or well, not stock it. An existing yes. classical song. Remember, royalty free. Yeah. The prince to send soldiers with you to help repair the soldiers? Dam. Oh yeah, the National time, Guard, I guess. The dam will break and everyone in the meadow will be drowned. We need the soldiers to. Oh wait, no. So it's not. So it's not the spring thaw. It's the dam is breaking. Goodbye, my daughter. Because of winter. Goodbye, okay. Because of global warming. Well, no, it's the end of winter. It's it's spring they have to stop, as opposed to what Don Bluth, I... where they had to end the winter and bring spring, right? This is so... This is... I'm sure gonna sleep all the night. Oh, you uh, are? Uh... And you know what? It, as, much as, as much crap as it gets, as bland and generic as it is, Golden Films is not the You're... worst. Don't torture that flower, you... You know what, what part you're you know what part you're touching? You're <laughs> oh, sleep on its dick! You just maybe the flowers are it. the flower. Look, it's dead now. <laughs> I was gonna say that their worst crime is just that they're painfully generic, for the most part. What? Oh God, a witch! Evil witch! Oh, what if she's actually a good witch? Like, Hunchback just watched, like, a, a Disney cartoon, as opposed to a full-length movie. This one had to make up a plot! Yeah? This is what we get! Now, is this a full-size witch? Or, yeah, it's a full-size witch. Oh, it is! Okay, so it's another, like, small- She smells little people. She can smell the broken stamen. <laughs> just, just put that flower out of its misery, there okay, you go. You gotta be careful not to damage the roots. She she get she's very flower loving. See? Oh, that sweet like 
12 frames a second. Here we go! Here we go! Oh, she's a spry old gal. <laughs> why, why does she need a, a, a borrower thumb? Well, she's got to make thing? them, she's got to mix Wait. them into her Smurf concoction to get the perfect Smurf dish. <laughs> or turn them into gold? What the fuck was Gargamel's endgame? I don't know. Well, well? Um, what the oh, fuck? Old lady shows up at door. Well, am I coming in? <laughs> sure. Is she like an exorcist? Of course, I, I have it right so Is this the mother from the snowman movie that she, she brought in a witch to like cure the, the daughter's illness? But where is the child you promised to find me? Oh! Oh! So this is the mother. You know what? That's fine. That's no child. That's uh, a tulip. Yes, Wait! She paid her to kidnap a kid? That's fucked well, up! I'm sure she didn't question how she got the kid. I guess I'll get my money back if this kid doesn't work out. I'll sue you. I'll hire a good team of lawyers. As... As dumb a statement as this is, I guess this makes more sense than her being just born from the flower. Is that she's just one of these little dwarfish races. <laughs> this, this is actually a deconstruction of the fairy tale! Yeah. <gasps> Look, just this- <laughs> She must have been born from the flower! Oh my god! It's magic! This is great! I love this! So She's beautiful and full grown. I didn't know if magic babies were born this way. This should be a fairy tale. I can't believe it. <laughs> this is hilarious. <coughs> now there's the walnut bed. That must have been in the in the book, right? This, this maybe. Oh, She's a sound sleeper. If it wasn't, I gotta give the writers credit for for <laughs> this. If it wasn't, then Don Bluth ripped off these guys. And this was uh. So this is after the anime version, though, right? Yeah. We looked it up, and the anime version came first, which yeah. is on our list eventually. All 51 episodes. No, I'm just kidding. It's okay. It's compra It's abridged in English. What if it turned out to be a gag dub? The first actual abridged series. That would be great. Where am I? Did you awake? I can't think of any gag dubs that oh, like I'm severely so shorten the episode count. I can't mean to shout. I'm so excited. Dual masters. How did I get here? Did they like well, that seriously matter. shorten it? All that matters it? is I don't that think, you're here. I don't know. No, what matters is that I've got to save the little people born in the flowers from. Hush now. Well, oh god, damn it! <laughs> this is. Crazy. See what I've made for you? A little lake mm. and a boat for you to float on. You're not. A she just wife, wants to play with dolls. <laughs> oh man! She's just. She's, the, she just needs a dog. She. She needs a pet, is what she needs. She needs a goldfish. I was gonna say, she's like, uh... Doll Taki. Remember in Dragon Ball GT, the creepy doll guy? Yeah! So that, that's her! I've got a new dress for you today, Thumbelina! She doesn't have a name, she was just known as my daughter! Oh, bless you, dear. We've had a busy first day together. You get some rest. She did. She we'll didn't escape. She, she couldn't. Look at how big she is. Yeah. What's her plan? Like. Some first day. Oh. No, you're going to sleep. Now's now's your chance. Figure out how to get out of this place. Walk out. Get to the prince and leave. <laughs> Just. No, it's fine. The bed's comfy. Sleepy time. I'm sleeping on a flower. It's pretty neat. Wait, that's how you got into this problem. What? She's just what I've been looking for. <laughs> At least it doesn't have tits. Oh, the window's broken. She could just like climb out. The derpy ass frog. No good son of mine. Oh, <laughs> okay. They kept so we, that. We traded up the. We traded up the. A superstar voice for a, a an Atlantic City smoker. <laughs> My no good son keeps gambling all our money away. No, it's the that's the old lady's the gambler. And away we go. Oh yeah. Cocktail. 
I'll tell you when I had enough. Now give me another. Me I feel well. really. I feel Ribbit. worse for Thumbelina. She got a Ribbit. mission. And... Ribbit. Oh hush! Don't wake her up. There's, there's oh. the asshole frog. There's away. Napoleon. No Ram it. Oh, he can't talk. Oh, so the the sun <laughs> is like a is like a a hikikomori. Son, I've got you a wife. Now you can move out. Whatever, mom. She can't escape. <laughs> this. This is this is surprisingly accurate to the Don Bluth one. Like I guess I, I guess it, they were actually both more off, faithful than we thought to the book. It's just that the this version thought that her being born from a flower was stupid, so she was just a kidnap victim. A multiple time kidnap victim. And she's also I guess she's slightly less stupid. <laughs> I, I, oh shit! It's a segmented B. Was that supposed to be a slap? Why are you fucking with her? Just leave her alone! You killed my favorite flower! I found it castrated! Oh. And dead. Dead. Bye! You think twice before you pick on a helpless little girl again! She just broke another thing's dick. <laughs> no, she's actually way more competent than Thumbelina was. Yeah. The other one, I mean. I wake up in a different place. Every time I fall asleep, I went. Sector <laughs> BS Frog! A familiar ceiling! The lack of animation just makes it worse. It's great! I'm a very small girl! Just <laughs> floating up with a single stationary face. <laughs> fucking Coke eyes! I feel like the son just doesn't want to put up with her mother. Yeah. Hi ho! But there's a whole kingdom of little people depending on me, so... Really? I only saw two, two of you. No, fuck you. You're getting married. Oh, this is terrible. Oh. How also, will she's... I ever get to the meadow? She hasn't cried once. She's yeah. been very... Oh, wait! The fish are coming! They're helper! Why? I don't know! But where's Giacomo? So was that- were they helping her, or did the they just want a snack? The fish and the frog have a blood feud. The fish don't want to let the- I'm moving kind of fast, Kinda. It's just like a, a girl holding her nose. Cause that's how you get a small person voice, right? Hello, I'm five feet inches tall! We welcome you to the lollipop you. Oh, she can swim now! Oh, yeah. It's still like rapids to her, though, so... Yeah. You mean the waterfall that is coming up? Oh no! Jackimo, you fuck! Oh no, the fish are fine. They fish bros. <laughs> they broke her. How the hell? You saved me. Redfish, blue fish. You don't happen to have any worms, do you? Hey, you no. got a cigarette? <laughs> nah, let's bail. Was that? Couldn't have. Been. That that one line sounded like uh, what's Bender guy's name? That guy. I, I, him, yeah. He's just... Ah, let's bail! Yeah. Bird? Bird, it's... It... Oh! Oh! Get back! Get away from me! Nope, just bird noises. It's just a bird! What beautiful singing. It... It speaks bird it hasn't learned to speak to French yet. Is that supposed to be a blue jay? No time. Uh, looks like those are... What's the... The thing from regular show? Oh! Are you all alone? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> so, high-pitched bird whistling then. Hello, I'm the bird. Would you like my help? I need to find my way south before winter. Anyway, I don't know where the metal is. Rape face, please! I understand, Spiral. Swallow! Oh, That's I thought he said Spyro. There are lots of little people pounding on me. Well, if we had met at some Would you like time, to follow me back to my nest, friends. please? If we'd met at another time, in another movie, we could have been friends. <laughs> but alas, I must go. Oh no, it's a storm. A... 
that bird never stopped creepy smiling. Yes. Okay. It's me. Who are you? Butterfly lady? Oh, thank you, my dear. It's not often I get such a nice compliment. From what? Where Who? are you heading? To the meadow of tulips. You don't happen to know where that is, do you? Oh, More royalty free classical. I fly around there all the time. I'd oh. be happy to give you a ride there. My oh, please? Just she just takes him back. She just takes him back to the, uh... The <laughs> nice. Where she came from. She's gonna take the whole thing? I guess Isn't so. It? Oh, she's just gonna... It's a motorboat now. No, no, she's they're gonna going! The... Wouldn't it have been easier just to fly the girl? Ah, oh, whatever. No, fuck it. Also, nice Casablanca reference there, buddy. I believe that a butterfly could carry a leaf that size. What the fuck? No, Miss Gilbert Godfrey, no! Alright, that- Stop making such a fuss or I'll drop you and you'll be crushed when you hit the water. Not- Okay. What the fuck? Everybody hey, you sound touch! Everybody sounds like they're East Coast nobody, no good roughnecks. And they also, like, never stop smiling. I needed a pet. But I'm a <laughs> Short, sweet, and to the point. You're awfully small to be a girl. Well, I am. What's that ugly thing? My new pet, and it's not ugly. Oh yeah, the Beatles <laughs> think she's ugly. Not a pet. Look at her hair and those eyes. They're colorful. Not black like ours. Who cares what? about her eyes? Your hair's brown, <laughs> Beetle. <laughs> You're colorblind. I got it. Are her feelers? Don't tell me she doesn't have feelers. She doesn't have any oh, tits. Look at what? That thing. Is he wearing a suit and tie? <laughs> <laughs> gotta, gotta do the beetle stocks. Yeah. The beetle stock market's gonna crash. Basically, she's just going to New York. This movie's 45 minutes, by the way. Yeah, this is... The second one is like 53. Now look at what you've done. My friends were all laughing at me. Everyone because holding their nose. I didn't do anything. You took me. Fine. Very Go assertive. Whatever it was you were doing. You're Still smiling. <laughs> I didn't want you anyway. So the butterfly was just like, oh well. She got kidnapped. I did nothing I can do. The piano is in overdrive. Dorothy's on it. <laughs> I, I, she was also on Fire Pro, by the way. Oh, our Dorothy. Yeah, Wainwright. So she's a heavyweight. I, I did. I, I think her weight list is unknown. Anyway, what? Oh, I've been wandering around for weeks. Oh, honeysuckle. I don't know where I oh, was. getting a snack. Pretty soon it's gonna be winter and the snow weeks? starts to fall. Weeks? It's only been like three days at most. Shut up. That dam, and here I am out in the middle of nowhere. Well, I'm not gonna be able to get anyone if I freeze overnight. I, I don't. <sighs> No, I don't think so. By the way, yeah, she's very confident. Gotta build a shelter. Also very hard. She she's like halfway between Don Bluth and Molina and Nausicaa. Yeah. Sweet frames. It's getting colder every day. Gotta save them. Frames cost money, you know. I think there's porn of this. I don't even know. No, no, right? No. This is the this is the counter thesis to Rule 34. This is. That's how we will make this, though, maybe some- A fucking bear! Hey, Balu! Did you- Hello? I can't stand these flies anymore. Okay. Uh, Are, you're opening your mouth more than you're talking. <laughs> what a goofy bear! I'm sorry, Thumbelina. What? He knows her by name? Gently around you. Oh, it's alright, big bear. Big bear. He's not even questioning that. Good news. What the fuck? I found a new beehive last night. Well, they just know each other. Oh. Did you have a chance to ask any of your friends which way the meadow of tulips is? I asked Ollie Owl, but he said. Ollie Owl. He just licked the lollipop twice and just did it. The bear's got a swagger. I was gonna say that she just gets taken back to the place she started from. No, the other meadow of tulips! But isn't it dangerous? Not for me, but it might be for you. Might be for you. There's actually 12 meadows of tulips. She doesn't know that they're actually all over the world, the tulips. 
Be careful, big By bear. Thirty <laughs> times the charm. Hive too much. That way the bees won't get angry. See, he sounds like the gargoyles from that that Hunchback movie. Oh, the ones that were like uh, jazz. You know, yes. Bees. Bears, your friend, and friends share things. Oh, bother. Don't they? That's why you're not going to be angry if I take some of your honey. That's good, little bees. That's Are we going to make progress nice on the movie soon? Bees. No, he's, he has to get his honey addiction sated. They just wanted... Oh, fuck a raccoon! They wanted to do a Winnie the Pooh parody, but they couldn't figure out a whole movie from that, so they just made it a scene in this. Oh, hey. Oh. Quiet. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh god, Sly Cooper's god got rabies. We gotta go to Feral. Sly! Sly, what's wrong, Sly? Get the antidote! <laughs> you wanna fuck I'm a bear! Try picking on someone your own size. Not like you! <laughs> what do you mean, like, like you? Good, good comeback. Yeah, fuck him up! This is a movie for four-year-olds, right? Yes. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Wait. Oh, no. The wolves are coming. Wolves. Oh, no. You're a bear! This, you can take this, them out! It feels like somebody's gonna die soon! Oh, they're actually cartoony wolves. And I've gotta help him. Yeah, you can help. Watch out, big bear! There's another wolf! Watch out! Three bears can't take- the three wolves can't take on a bear! Oh, fuck that. Bears are- bears are nasty! Like, they're- they- We never oh. run and ran into a bear demon in Inuyasha. Oh, Night on Bald Mountain! Good choice! There's Chernabog. <laughs> this is- <laughs> Didn't expect a fight scene! No! This is more than what- Oh no, there was a fight scene at Thumbelina. You can get him! Oh yeah, the- <laughs> She grabs, grabs a stick and helps out! The prince got clubbed in the- He got a fucking concussion from a torch. That was the fight scene. Yeah. I'll get him! Wait! That actually worked! Big bear. Is that it? They weren't looking at something else? The wolves sure turned tail and ran, didn't they? Maybe <laughs> yeah, they did! <laughs> you gotta act like you're bigger than they are, then they'll flee. But Put your arms up, Thumbelina. I always say she is. What? I wouldn't have been brave enough to stand up to three wolves. Couple more goofy <laughs> bears. <laughs> Thumbelina, Where the brothers. fuck does this take place? I don't know, they're wolves, they're bears. Is this Pacific Northwest? It feels like it. Look at those trees. It's not Denmark. Or France. Oh, everybody sounds American as fuck. I hate to break this up. Now his nose is blue. The sleep cave. I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, they gotta hibernate. We gotta go to the great fish event. Comes Winter is coming. I, I thought they were. I thought it was sp a spring problem. Yeah, it wasn't it the melting of winter. Oh, this is gonna last a whole other season. The dam will be fine. It's got months left. Unless this works on the same. Uh, does this work on the same season scale as Don Bluth? Like where seasons last two days? The opposite of uh, of uh, Westeros. Yeah. Oh, nature's funny that way. Nature's fun. The sad music. Like, the bears are going to die. Oh, we got it. Oh, man. Is this movie film gonna end with everybody dying? That'd be bold for Golden Films. This one's a, like... You don't understand. This is the only royalty-free music they could find. <laughs> By the way... I, I will agree that, Th that Thumbelina is the most competent, like, protagonist we've seen yet from these watches. We've only watched three, to be fair. We watched yeah. this, Hunchback, and, uh... Hunchback has literal magic powers, and she's more competent. The, uh... What is it? The legend? The mystery of the snowman? Yeah, that secret... 
the Secret of the Snowman. Secret. <laughs> that, that was the worst one. <laughs> yeah, they the protect. Those were the worst protect. Oh, the snowing. In terms of both writing characters and animation. Father, what's your right about the snow this winter? Ow! That's how she dies. She just gets concussed from a winter. snowflake. And no closer to getting to the meadow of tulips. What else could possibly go wrong? Maybe Pedo Bird will show up again. That bird has the creepiest fucking smile. And also, that voice. Yeah. It was, totally, it was totally like a predator situation. <laughs> I'm tired. So hungry. And then the moles come. Marry the mole. It stops Oh, that's cool. Are you gonna go live in a boot? No, she she has to get saved by the mouse first. Yeah, the mouse gotta save her. Ms. And mouse. Then, and then sell her to a mole. Or after a jaunty rising musical number. It's a, oh, it's a farm! There's bound to be some food left over. Is from this behind. is this the scene I where it's a babe parody? I guess she knows about about giant humans. Yeah. Oh, Fox! Mr. Fox, no! Wow, well, lucky what we got here. Oh no, it's a hick fox! Oh God! Thanks for helping oh. me. <laughs> Deliverance! What do you think I'm the farmer's wife? Because what? the farmer who owns this here farm had such a small harvest, I figured you went and shrunk up from lack of food. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're so funny, Fox. I was gonna ask, did you ever see the uh, the I'm Country Bears, the wife. 3D movie? The what? The joke. Country Bears? Hey, I have not. Want, no. It was very short-lived. They did a 3D <laughs> movie of. What was, you know, the Disneyland ride? Yeah. Or attraction. I guess it didn't work out. Go on, okay. guy, Fox! There must be something yeah, I ain't worth it. I regulate. Regulate all the steel it off this property. Yeah. Yeah, Damn good too. There's gotta be a few kernels of corn lying under the snow know, somewhere around here. Do you know the oh, way me. back to the little people land? Yeah, it's back the way you came. Good luck. Oh, they just went their separate ways. All right. That was an encounter. The fox is like, I can't help you. Dramatic music. I'll some corn kernels. She's trying Why to find food. No. That she only needs one kernel. Yeah, because she's small. She's downsized. That's the joke. Hmm, I've never thought about it before, but I'm willing to try anything. Good old Moroku. <laughs> I got it! I found a It's pen. gold! Oh, it's only a pebble. I can't eat this. That's... Oh, no! Oh, no. Impossible, you say. <laughs> I don't think she's that desperate yet. We shall eat snow. No! <laughs> Music change. There's no food around here. Don't some birds like eat rocks to help them digest? Or is that just dinosaurs? I think that was dinosaurs. Sounds like singing. No, that's a trumpet. It is singing. It is? You can do impossible things. Maybe that's a myth because of because they like found a bunch of rocks where the stomach would be and they're like, hey! It's proof. Um, oh, is that the mouse? Is that Shrek's house? Looks like a swamp hut with pristine white it's walls. It's the mouse! She looks the it's closest the to the Don Bluth incarnation. Yeah. Hi. I guess there are only so many ways you can draw a homely mouse. Yeah. Oh, my, my, my. Such a tiny human. What do you want? Is she... Human? I'm cold. Uh, she's hungry. I'm cold. I need food. Hungry. Uh, need food. Oh, Dying. Dear, oh, dear, Send oh, dear. red shirts. You have frozen child. Come in. Come child. In, come in. Come in. Oh, you are welcome. Oh, that's, that's also nice the closest word. voice. Yeah. I can't wait for her to turn into an asshole. <laughs> this goes to show just how talented Channing Tatum was. Yeah. Channing Tatum. 
Or Not Carol Channing. Yeah, that's the Close one. enough. Sure. Channing you Tatum is the notebook dude. Am I? Am I At least? Heaven? Oh, am I in heaven? After what you've just gone through, I can understand your thinking that. <laughs> you must At least if the characters are less so asshole in this version. The, yeah, everybody's kind of nice. Even the fox. Even the beetle kidnapped her was like, No, shut up, friend. She's pretty. I like her. All right, I'll let her go. All these classical pieces. Yeah. This is a noted problem in a lot of these films. I, yeah, I would imagine. Oh, I'm so g cold. Oh, of course you are, my dear. So a lot of these you are uh, directed shopping. and produced by the same one person. You it's Diane me, something or other. I'll do anything Di you ask. Do you th uh, oh, let me see. Don't turn me out. Diane Eskenaz. Oh, Eskenaz? Nazi! <laughs> oh, no! Yes, Eskimo and the Nazis teamed up. Diane Eskenazi. <laughs> We can talk in the morning. I was gonna say, do you think that was just her doing the song in the intro? Oh. That's the only song we've had, and probably the only one we'll get. Yeah, this isn't a music. Wait, nope! <laughs> you are incorrect! Greet me, soft and white, clean and bright. You look oh, she has to work for her now. The mouse is probably also the best actress in this. Oh, yes. by the way, that was wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Oh, oh she was she singing. Sorry. Right. She got new clothes. Here. Oh, thank you, Mona. You've been so Mona. Kind of Mona. Me, but I gotta get to the meadow of... Yes, yes, I know. The meadow of the oh, two of us. You have to stop the sand from breaking. I've stayed here and worked hard to show you how grateful I am to you for saving my life. They're actually making an effort to my match the... Everyone else in the meadows it's not just flaps. Me. There's a little and bit I of movement for the syllables. The yeah. Warm them up. There, there. I heard you. Heaven knows you've told me the story about the cracks in the dam often enough this winter. Well, yeah. I've got good news for you. Yeah. Everybody's dead. You don't have to go. You don't have to go out anymore. The village is gone. Mr. Mole. Mr. Mole. Gentlemen. The prophecy is coming full circle. Of course, since most spend most of their time underground. <laughs> but he's very rich, and he lives in a fine home much larger than okay. mine. I think he'd be most happy to meet you. Okay. You will sing for him, won't you, dear? Uh, the singing thing is oh, back. Of course. Yeah. But do you really think he knows the way to the middle of the you have to frown. She's still trying to hook up. Hook up Mr. Mole with with Thumbelina. Why? Under the pretext that oh yeah, he'll totally show you the way to the dam. Yeah. This, this through line of just got to do some things for him first. We want the house to look especially nice when Mr. Mole arrives. She's more devious than this. One. Look at her. She, like, she wants her to get eaten! Uh, quickly, quickly, uh, finish setting the table, girl! So she still is the same character. She wants to get on good terms with Mr. Mole, so that she yeah. gets some of that money. You look divine. Yep. Thank oh. you, Mona. I'm coming! I'll be right there! I feel like the characters between these two movies we saw should be switched. Yeah. Like the one that skews towards a slightly older oh, audience. Oh, he looks... He looks all right. He looks like a Winnie Let's the Pooh character. Pooh, Mona. Yeah. But uh, I can see if you that is. This is like... <laughs> he, looks, he looks like Mole Pooh Bear. <laughs> Look at how cuddly that motherfucker is. It's just... He looks like a cross between Winnie the Pooh and the old man from Pop. Oh. Delightful. I have been looking forward to meeting. Where Thumbelina. is she? Bring her here. <laughs> Mr. Mole, this is Thumbelina. Thumbelina. In her finest schoolgirl outfit. Mole. Yeah, she Can looks like the uh, the Shining twins. <laughs> Come, like it's that kind of outfit. Come sing with us mm, forever. I must say ever. it was a delicious dinner. Thumbelina, you're a wonderful cook. Uh, now marry me! Oh, um, she could. Mona told me you might be able to help me find the Meadow of Tulips. Mm, the Meadow of Tulips? The who about where now? Yes, 
I can't even find my way to the bathroom at night. <laughs> no, it's during the day he's got a problem with. Yeah. Mole's got good eyesight. Oh, yes. In the dark. That's right. Uh, the, the middle of tulips. Oh. We'll certainly have to talk about that, won't we? Before I saw how cuddly he was, I said I was going to say I wanted to see a mole voice by Danny DeVito. Mr. <laughs> I thought we were going to talk That's about the That's too moment. obvious. Yeah. Plenty of time for talking later. The dirt man. Did she just leave? <laughs> you think she could fight him off if she had to? <laughs> She's proven competent in everything else, aside from maybe a little logic flaws, but yeah. Have a nice song for Mr. Bowl. I want to go home. Of smell may you bloom and grow. So, bloom second. and grow forever. This is the second song. Anal yeah. Vice, well, technically third, but. Anal Vice? <laughs> that sounds like the name of a, of a punk band. Yeah. <laughs> A, a lot of these voice actors sound very familiar, but they're obviously not whoever I'm thinking they are. Why? Okay, mom. To be fair, we haven't seen any real mother of hers yet. Just the old man, Santa Pixie. Yeah. You want to go to the meadow of tulips for your honeymoon, and you'll be on your way. What? What kind of strategy is that? Yeah, just make promises you can't keep. It's a great idea. Oh, hey! Winter's Fire. come! Or past? The, the dam is broken. Hello! Oh, Mona. oh dear, I took a wrong term at Al Albuquerque. I, so often I, thought it would be easier just to dig I want to see a series about this mole, just a fumbling blind old like It's like uh, Mr. McGee, what's the, Why don't you the old blind guy? Look at yeah, him. Tunnel. It's like that, but with a cuddly old mole. Just winding up into wacky situations because he can't great, see. He's the greatest protagonist to a cartoon that was never made. Magoo. Morning. Mr. Yeah. Magoo. It's so yeah. dark in here, I can barely see. I, I can see just fine. No, you get used to it, my dear. You come to love the dark as I do. Okay, <laughs> okay Bane! Interesting things in the I was going to say Phantom. But, but for instance, look at this. <laughs> you merely adopted the dark. Oh. oh, it's Blue Jay! It's the bird I barely knew. Now, how, however did a bird get down here? Birds are not the smartest of creatures, you know. <laughs> Oh, bird this is slightly less dramatic than the one when she actually knew the bird. You could oh, you know, he's just some dude anymore. who tried to, like, you know, <laughs> go predator on me for a little while. This could be the bird who sang to me. Could be. They all he look the same, right? Bird. He was? Don't be a oh, is, is the bird her romantic interest? One from the other. I mean, it's not like the they heard the prince of that any kind of fucking no. Oh, which is probably for the best. Yeah. Oh, what if she eats him for like two minutes and then just falls in love with them? Yeah. That's how this is gonna end it's up. It's just like probably. first sight. Yeah, I'm sleeping now. Are you asleep? Okay. <laughs> Good shot. <laughs> Just popping in and out. The <laughs> it was so shaky. It didn't work on any level. It's yeah. Great. Now she's sneaking out because she's in a home her own size. Now she's giving the bird a blanket. Cause fuck it. No, bird, I love you. I don't care what they say. I think he looks exactly like the swallow who said. And then he rears up and bites her head head off. Because <laughs> birds are fucking predators. At least you got something to keep the chill away while you rest forever. Like dolphins. Do dolphins Precious eat meat? Bird. Dolphins are, are rapists. Oh. If you are the swallow, they okay, fun. That I time I was talking about the natural kind of predator, because oh. birds eat meat. I, oh, yeah. Well, they eat like worms and bugs. 
You're alive! Then why did you bring a blanket to him if you thought he was dead? Stay right here. Don't move. You know, it was a thought that counts. I'll be right back. So it opened its eyes for a little and then okay there. Oh, I knew you were the spot. Is it gonna talk again? Me. In that creepy voice? That's gonna sing. Here? After I yep, left you, I got lost. In Shatnerism. Winter trying to survive. And then I wounded my wing on a thorn bush. Oh. When I landed, I dug into the ground to keep warm and then I fell into this place. So she didn't, ha so well, he didn't help her out at all. He just kind of fucked off. He offered her help and she said, No, I'm good. Who's Mr. Mole? Oh. And he was oh, like, Maybe in another movie we could have been friends. For someone who's getting married, you don't sound very happy. That's because I don't want to marry you. I'll be well soon. I can fly you away from here. I can't go. When Mona... From this angle, he looks so wide-faced, like a job of the hut in the corner of the screen. She asked. What? So... Oh, she's Maybe trapped by a life debt? Do you know where the Meadow of Tulips is? No, I'm afraid I don't. Oh, that's all right. Not the Vale of the Fairies, the Meadow of Tulips. Vale of Fairies sounds more fantastical. It's more specific, for one thing. I'll miss you when I leave. And I'll miss you. I mean, I guess, unless there are a bunch of fairies and a bunch of veils. What? Is this Fugue? No. Oh. <laughs> Not enough, uh, flute, I guess. No, fu a Fugue is an organ piece. Oh, okay. Oh, it's spring again! Oh, there's a dam gonna collect- Oh, hey! Ho, ho, ho! I wonder where my daughter is. Oh, well. Where can she be? The cracks are getting worse. You having a bad day, Papa Smurf? Hopefully this water's rising. The dam won't hold out much longer. All right. Isn't this just the most beautiful dress you've ever seen? Yes, it's very beautiful. Well, she's still you don't going sound along with this. <laughs> she's too <laughs> polite to like just, say, yeah. oh, fuck you. Now and the snow is going up in the She's given up on her mission Maybe because of this life debt down, thing. But if I could get to the meadow, I could this still- This demon's fucking mouse! Me. She's the villain! She's the villain! The mole was the villain in the original one! She's the villain in this one! Well, the frog was more- There were several villains in the previous one. Everyone kind of was one. Everybody here gives up way too easily. Ah, oh, it feels so good to be in the sunlight. Oh, she has cleavage. It exists. The rest of your life, so I they animated you enjoy it. One yep. last look at the sun in the sky. But I thought you said Mr. Mole would take me to the Meadow of Tulips. I'm sorry to say so, Thumbelina, but you know moles spend their lives underground. You I lied. <laughs> now I've got some last-minute wedding business to take care of. And she leaves. Just leave. Take the dress and go. No! Nope. <laughs> can't be taking that old coop so long. If he dares to try backing out of our deal, I'll... Hello, Mona. Oh, he's off having some wacky misadventure in some other cartoon. <laughs> and even a more beautiful day to pay the one who introduced you to your blushing bride. I failed. I let down... Oh, she is giving up! Away. The prince... Everyone's gonna be swept away when the dam breaks and... Cause she's too honorable. Yeah. You know, life debt more important than a bunch of people's lives. You're my best friend, Bird. I found the meadow of tulips you asked me about. He's got the best voice. Then there's still time. I promised to marry Mr. Mole. But if I don't go back and warn everyone about the dam bursting... Maybe Mr. Mole will let you put off the wedding He has double chins, to go but he's a bird. He's fat! That's a he has double idea. beaks. Yep. I'll ask Mona to... Don't! There's Mr. Mole. Don't ask, just leave! Well, she's... Back to the same, Guys, just the mouse I music. I a fine choice for a bride. Oh, Morton, you'll have a little Morton Mole. Morton. She thinks you're going to take her to the meadow of tulips for her honeymoon. Foolish girl! Doesn't she know oh. moles spend their lives underground? That was the most villainous thing she he said. Knows. Foolish girl! Sure, she loves. What a cuddly her. asshole! I don't understand. I don't, you don't! You don't! With Mr. Mole. Okay, maybe she is as stupid as the other one. For getting you to marry him. And he'll never take me to the meadow. 
Oh, well, not quite. She sold me to him. Mona lied to me all along. Yeah. I'm not gonna feel bad about leaving her. Oh. Take me to the metal oh. tulip swallow. Please so this is why she's wearing a wedding dress on the cover of the movie. <laughs> and the bird. Spoiler! There we go. Is that just gonna be a screenshot? Yeah, you know, yeah, oh, she's in there. Yeah, I was confused for a second. Is this just gonna be a screenshot? We're gonna see this exact shot in the movie? Uh, maybe, maybe not. Oh no, the dam would hold much longer. That looked like a the Dragon Ball Z first. shot, them rocks for a late. second. It's just too late. It's too late. They're all de Oh, and then poop. Oh! You gotta swallow! The birds are assisted! Who are all the soldiers? Well, we didn't even see her. Are we even gonna see the prince? No! Fuck that, the we got a damn to fix! Wait, wait, why are you- You're wearing a wedding dress?! I got married! Grandpa? Father? That's father, right? Fa- I, I think- You made it! But how on earth? With some help from my friend. <laughs> so what do you think? She married she, the bird. What do you think she is? Like 18? Is she uh, supposed to be? I think so, yeah. She's like Nausicaa age. Yeah, vague. vague. Oh, look at all those, those fucking dapper as hell, like. Yeah. We're off to build the bridge, build a dam. So I guess he's, old, he's living here just because he has to keep watching the dam and let people know when shit's gonna go down. Sure. And when Thumbelina grows up, she will take care of the dam as well. Yeah. That's cool. Is this just some, like, British national composition? Maybe. Is that they're supposed to be British? I don't know. Are you in Britain this entire time? The dam is saved. Thanks to your daughter. There's the prince, I, I think. Are, is it love at first sight? Yep, it is. <laughs> your majesty, rise. I should be bowing before you. My people owe you a great deal. <laughs> you said you're you sound life. enthusiastic about it. Will you marry me? <laughs> there it is. I told you this would happen. Oh. It's the only way to end the movie. Yeah. You know what? You know what though? Maybe this happened in the book. It's a fairy tale. <laughs> it's definitely happened in the fucking book. No, that did great. That did great. Rule them. <laughs> K, C, and D, Asia. Caesar Martinez. Eensy Weensy Productions. Get it? Group Zen. I'm looking for voices. A lot of Japanese They're names. They're not gonna show the voices. This was Japanese animated. Or at least partially. There were a lot of Japanese names. 1992, AFI. You know what? I could see a, a, a five-year-old falling asleep to this. <laughs> That's my review of this movie. <laughs> five. Good sleep material for five-year-olds. Thumbelina, are you awake? Close. All right. So, uh, yeah, that did exactly. Well, then, who the fuck is Tom Thumb? Is she going to cheat on the prince with Top Thumb? I don't know. We'll get to that. Should we talk about this? Is the this? prince's name Top Thumb? Should we talk about this one first? Uh, it was, it was okay. It was better than the Snowman movie. It was very abridged, abridged very short. I like the voice actor for the Bluebird. <laughs> yeah. That, he was, that, that was a smooth voice. It wasn't as bad after the first scene. Like The, the first scene when he was just constantly smiling. Yeah. That was a little a disturbing, mood. but okay, yeah. It was such a stoic smile, though. <laughs> like like a smile of a sociopath? Like a fake smile, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like the characters were all there. It had roughly the same kind of plot as the other was, one. Yeah, and I guess very the book. rough. It was kind of the same sequence of events, loosely. Yeah. Better in some places, which we pointed out. <laughs> I mean, We never saw the, the quote-unquote mother again. No, <laughs> the mother was one of the villains. Yeah, so she came by, out of by a flower. <laughs> that was so. I, that was my favorite part where they're like, "Oh, she came out of a flower." That's stupid. We don't even know that it was a witch. Maybe it was just an old lady with an odd choice of attire. It was an old lady with an odd choice of attire, and she showed and a no, money problem. She showed no magic powers. All she did was sniff out a, a little girl and pick a flower. She's. I mean. <laughs> She was she was paid a lot of money to like, can you give me a kid? Yeah, sure, give me some money. And then she's like, 
oh, fuck, what am I going to do? Maybe she was a witch and, like, the mom thought, oh, she'll just, like, magically create a child into being it, but the witch was lazy. She didn't want to spend the mana. She just went and found a, a little person. <laughs> and then, yeah, yeah, this is your child now. You think they're common knowledge to the humans? The humans are common knowledge to them. Yeah, I imagine... Like, the humans know about them, and the mom's just like, oh, this is stupid, you just kidnapped the witch this knew. The witch knew about it. I, I imagine you have to be knowledgeable, and that... That woman looked looked dumb as a sack of bricks. Yeah, she did. Saw her for all of two minutes. <laughs> I love how that that the mother was a not as much of a non entity in this as it was in the other Thumbelina, though. I did like it in the <laughs> other one though, where she's just the worst parent ever because she doesn't go look for the lost child. Yeah, she's just like, oh, she's things gone. Will work out. Meanwhile, we don't give a fuck. It. She disappeared. Now she's hassling that witch for her money back. <laughs> <Yeah>, she <laughs> That's she disappeared problem. on me! She did what? I told you I'd come for you, you old bitch! That's the plot we're not seeing, is her getting her money back from the witch. <laughs> this also had far less musical numbers, so yeah. I, I'll, I'll give this one credit. Alright, so we, we move right on to Tom, Tom Thumb, Thumb and Thumbelina, right? Let's see, let's see how this, uh, this love triangle happens. I guess. I don't know what happened. That'll be a separate video then. Yeah. No. So th thanks for watching this one, and uh, it'll go up at the same time. If you can get, if you can, like, watch it with us, go watch the Tom Thumb one. Yes. See you later. See ya. You dirty bird, get out of my kitchen! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, there's... Wait! <laughs> but you're... What is that? What? <laughs> Did they? Oh, fuck! Your kids won't know the difference. Hi, Cookie. Just testing the Cookie. Cookie. Mm.